Hello, my name is Joe, and what we're going to be looking at today is how to switch between the different types of anti-aliasing or AA and Unreal Engine. If you find this helpful, please like, subscribe, and hit that bell for more videos. And don't forget to check out my website, 3dassetlibrary.com, for Unreal and Unity Engine assets. So, inside Unreal here, now what's going to happen is you may or may not see differences in um, the AA when we switch this, um, only due to uh, YouTube's. Uh, compression on this sometimes it's not brilliant uh, so bear that in mind please but at your end you should obviously see the results a lot better so how we switch between our different types of AA is if we go to edit here go to project settings now you can just type in the top here uh, AA or anti-aliasing but I'll show you this way so we'll go to rendering and in here we have lots of different things to do reflection quality all sorts so if we scroll down to default settings and anti alias method, method, and here we've got our different types of AA. So, what I, as I say, I'm not sure 100% if YouTube will show this. Um, so, what we'll do is we'll just scroll down and we've got none. So, uh, at my end, you can see it's all jaggedy here. Um, we've got FXA. I believe that's the default for Unreal. Um, that sort of, I think, from my understanding, essentially blurs the more contrasty parts of the image. Um, then you've got Temporal AA. Um, that sort of uh, goes into all buffer stuff. I'm not going to go into all that, that geeky stuff. If you, you know, it's, it can, just gets a bit too much. <laughs> and um, uh, but what we'll, uh, if you want to know more about this, obviously all on the Unreal website. Uh, what it does then you've got um msaa um this does this for me is a bit jaggedy um this i think i believe these all depend on what type of a rendering solution you're using um so always bear that in mind i'm just showing you how to change th between these um for people that want to know um as i say all of the really detailed stuff of what does what etc is all online um but sometimes um as i say by default i believe it's fxaa it's the default that just generally works but as i say it can add potentially a little bit of blurring into your textures um but yeah hopefully this has helped if it has cheers